Hello friends, welcome back to our kitchen. Today we're making some wonderful zucchini patties. They're made from simple ingredients, among them zucchini. We also have carrots. Find the exact ingredients in the description box below. But for sure, here we have um we have some zucchini we have grated it's equivalent to a cup there you go the zucchini here we have carrots we have grated here we have green bell paper you can use red or yellow here we have some spring onions um you can use celery instead here i have half a cup of uh, chickpea flour we have some lemon juice this is just to add to the taste we have flax meal for binding we have cassava flour also for binding and to our spices we have paprika turmeric and cumin powders so those are our ingredients all we have to do is just to mix all this in a big bowl and here is the bowl I will add all the ingredients. So there we are adding our spring onions. We'll follow this with our papers. Slowly. The next we added our zucchini and carrots. Begin by mixing this first. So at some point, um you'll have to graduate to your hands so this is after mixing the spices um, the cassava flour followed by the flax meal then the lemon juice you can also use lime and now I'm adding my chickpea flour I decided to keep this gluten free so you can even use a uh, whole wheat flour if you don't mind so I'm mixing this with my hand um, it will become wet at some point this is just okay after mixing this is how it's looking it's very wet and it's okay so I'll allow this to rest for 10 minutes so that the flax can absorb the moisture so after 10 minutes i'll oil my baking tray and make some shapes of parties and this is how they are looking so this will go to a preheated oven of 200 degrees celsius uh, i'll bake them for 30 minutes on one side and 30 minutes on the other side you want to bake them until they are firm and they are crispy so here you go we are turning now and taking them back to the oven uh, to bake for another 30 minutes mm, you can eat this with some burgers instead of the burgers uh, you can do this as the filling this is just a simple recipe where you can hide some vegetables inside and it's tasty. If you like this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. If you wish to see more plant-based recipes, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified whenever we upload a new recipe. I'll be glad to get your feedback. Otherwise, have a blessed week. Bye.